Hi, I'm Rochelle, the mother of the mother-daughter team of Godiva's Secret Wigs. And I don't know about you, but I must confess, I do enjoy watching the reality shows with the housewives because A, I think I get my little dose of estrogen from being with them, so to speak, and B, they remind me to kind of up my game. And so today, in honor of the housewives of Beverly Hills today, I have my eyelashes on, I have some extra contouring, some shine, I have shaded my nose and added some bright sh little white shine up my nose, and I've got my pretty jewels on. And my glitz, because I want to talk about glamorous grays. So, so many women, once they go gray, they just kind of stop getting too fancy and just kind of day to day on autopilot. And I'm, that's the same for me too, and I'm a blonde, and many of us women, we just get into a rut, into the same thing. So I want to show you how I kick up and glamorize some gray wigs. These are my four favorites for right now. So the first is Freedom. That's called Freedom Wig. And the, this color is called Silverstone. I know many of you have it. Now look at it. It's not even at the right place yet, but I shake it because I want that fullness, right? So now instead of grabbing the wig and pushing it and flattening these sides, no, 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 I don't want to do that. So up at the hairline very slowly, then I get under the hair and make sure the tabs that are on all of our Godiva secret wigs, they need to be even because if one's up here and one's down here, the wig's not going to feel great, comfortable, or secure on you. So up at the hairline, then make sure the tabs are flat right against your hairline, your temples, okay? And then I can just be done. I mean, do you see how easy freedom is? I love freedom. Yay. If I want to pump it up a little bit, I can spritz some water. You know, I believe in keeping my wigs. I have many wigs that are 8, 10, 12 years old that I still wear because like many of you who own 2 to 20 and 30 and 40, I have a nice number of wigs myself. And guess what? They don't wear out because I'm not wearing the same wig every day. So spritzing with water just kind of keeps the wig, the fibers, these are all very high quality synthetic. It keeps the fibers from going dry. But look how cute. Freedom is just such an easy, great wig to wear. So I wanted you to see that. And if I want, I might use our Keep It There Low Alcohol Hairspray. It comes in eight ounce and two ounce. And it's very light, even if your hair, um, if you're using gentle items on your hair, but you feel that you want hairspray, use our Keep It There because the high water content, low alcohol, doesn't dry out your hair or your wigs. It's really good. So I can either spritz it on my hands and then run it through and then get my hands off of it, let it dry like that, or I could do a little spritz. If I really wanna punk it up, I'm gonna bend all the way over and fan it and keep my hands off until it's dry. But isn't that the sweetest? I love it. I love the wispiness around the face. And by the way, Freedom Wig, we make in petite, average, and large. So it's wonderful for everybody. There it is. I'm showing some ears and I'll even take it behind so you can see like that. Okay. Next wig I want to show you is a short wig. This is called Quinn 
and the color is sandy silver. So I shake every wig and before I do anything, up at the hairline, even the tabs. Okay, so a question was asked many times, can I part a wig either way? And my answer is yes, sometimes. And that's because the way the wigs are made, sometimes you can part them right to left like this. I'm just taking my fingers and playing. Look, I can even bring them in front and do a crazy little Halloween look. Or I can take it all to left to right. But to me, it doesn't matter so much what side you part your own hair on. Consider and look at the wig. How does the wig look best on you? So I just love Quinn because it's just easy. It's easy and on a hot day, love it. So I'm actually just spritzing, spritzing this whole wig, the front. I just want some pieciness. And look how even when I'm dressed up, Quinn looks great. It's, it's terrific, I love it. So making a wig piecey can still be messy to be glamorous, but I think that's a good look. <laughs> I just had to have a little portrait there for a moment. So next wig we are going to show you is Abigail. I know many of you are saying, I love Abigail. I have it in three, four colors. And it's amazing for those of you that haven't seen it, you know, you're going to love it right now. So Abigail is a lace front wig. Oh, by the way, this color is silver mink, beautiful color. So lace front ladies, here's what I mean. So let's start low so you can see and watch how my scalp, it appears that my scalp moves. You're still bringing it all the way up to your hairline. And with Godiva's secret lace front wigs, you do not cut the lace. We do not suggest gluing the lace onto your head. You still can attach your wig and secure it many different ways. You know, Danielle and I have made for you probably over 380 wig videos right now, all different topics, tutorials, tips, tricks, everything to help build your confidence in making a choice and loving how you, how you like your hair every day. So look, I haven't taken a brush to this. I haven't teased it. Look. And I really, I just love it. It's messy. And what I would do is probably just trim a few wispy bangs. You can do it yourself by following one of our tutorials or take the wig to a hairdresser and just make sure they go slow because this hair is not growing back. Now, I want to brush it the other way just to show you. Mmm. Ooh la la. Kind of like this. I wish Danielle was here. <laughs> but look how pretty that is. So, Abigail parts either way. And look at this. I can take it and show my forehead. So, when I'm wearing a lace front wig, I don't know about you, but I love to be looking at a menu or talking to people and say, oh, let me see, what am I doing this weekend? I just, I don't remember. And check this out. It's fantastic. Now remember, all the wigs that I'm showing you do not only come in these colors, they come in gorgeous reds, blondes, browns, and we even have gorgeous, luscious white wigs, beautiful, rich something that you would feel comfortable to wear. And wigs just up our game. Do you see how it kind of lifts me up? And uh, so this is Abigail, love her. So the fourth wig that I'm going to show you, 
I love in red also and many colors, but this is Sabrina in silver stone. And Sabrina is an A-line wig. Let me show you. With a bang. So remember, just get the hair out of your eyes, up to your hairline always. And then even the tabs, like I've taught you. And I want to show you Sabrina. So cute. Many clients just want to wear it flat and natural. Show you what I do. It's rare that I even take a brush to my wigs because I just love getting my hands in there. But whatever you want to do, great. So let me show you this sweet little A-line. And even this hair down here, that's not mine. I'm not great yet. But that is the wig. And look at this edgy, beautiful wig. We have many other styles of gorgeous gray wigs, but today I'm showing you these four. So let's say you're gonna doll up, you wanna dress it up a little bit. See how I'm starting to give it a little lift here, just playing. But I can use my teasing brush. We sell different types of brushes and they're all great. So I'm gonna take a little bit and just tease down, 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 holding the hair and see how just giving it that height just dresses it up a little bit. I'm going to spritz just right there. And our wigs, our, um, our bangs on our wigs do come long and that's so our clients around the world can customize the wig. A simple little trimming, that's all you need to do. So there you go. Another way I love to wear Sabrina is around one ear to show my cute earrings and then keep that longer side sexy and long. And I don't know about you, but I think I'm going to have my husband take me to dinner tonight. <laughs> so please, if you're watching this today and you're not familiar with Godiva's Secret Wigs, please check out and subscribe to our videos. We have hundreds of videos. My daughter and I have been doing this passionate work, Godiva's Secret Wigs, since 1997. And we ship all over the world. And our clients just love the ease and the convenience. It's not necessarily about having a hair issue. And if you do, we are here to help you. But if you're not having an issue, but you're busy, uh, you travel, you work and you need to look good, you've just started a new life and maybe you've had some work done, maybe you're in a new personal lifestyle change and you want to try things, you want a little makeover and wigs are magic, our wigs kind of are like wearing a beautiful mask and they give you permission to just be who you want to be. So I hope you enjoy this little video about Glamorous Grays and uh, I loved making it for you. Danielle and I love making all of our videos for you. We hope you enjoy them and we appreciate your purchases and we just absolutely love what we do. So thank you so much. We love your comments and your suggestions. And I know we'll talk very soon, okay?